Well, imagine yourself being behind bars at the age of 15 and having to stay there until you're 21. One woman's journey from incarceration to inspiration is the subject of tonight's University of Maine at Prescott's Distinguished Lecturer Series. Dick Palm has more. Stasha Ague spent her early life as the abused and neglected daughter of a drug-dealing father and a mother who was an addict and a prostitute. And it didn't get much better after that. Her mother kicked her out of the house at the age of 11. Yeah, I made some poor choices and spent from the time I was 15 until I was 21 incarcerated. For what? Um, two counts of first-degree kidnapping and robbery in the first degree. Aggie was able to turn her life around after meeting a woman at a youth camp who had gone through tough times like Aggie had. Um, she just had so much hope and she was such an inspiration. It was then that I um, had decided that I was going to get my act together and that if she could do it, I could do it too. She began work on her bachelor's degree in criminal justice while still in prison and would eventually be pardoned by the governor of Washington state. And so because I've been through the system and um, I've, got, I've gotten out and then want to come back and work, work with them, it gives them hope and inspiration and so uh, it kind of allows them to be able to open up more and, and, and talk about the, the real things that need to be changed. Now Agu is paying it forward by becoming a champion for at-risk youth of today. Bringing awareness about the kind of youth that are in our juvenile justice system and helping bridge the gap, hopefully, in advocacy uh, around juvenile justice and the child welfare system. Dick Palm, New Source 8. And that talk is tonight at 7 o'clock at the Umpy Campus Center.